understand we're back, but they'll be talking a lot, so I'll see where I can talk. Don't worry, <laughs> sir. I shall follow you wherever fate may take us. I should have done something in the throne room. I should have stopped him. All you would have accomplished would have been your own death. Still, maybe I should have taken you away sooner. There is something rather sinister about this garden at night. Where are we going? I, I thought we were leaving the castle. We are. But there's something we must do first. Alright, so... They'll keep talking. I'm just... I'm just trying not to talk since my microphone makes this static noise and... It's better the to just let them talk without me talking on it. <laughs> to Albion's last hero. I never thought I'd enter this place again. You should have known better. The night your father died, I promised him I would bring you here one day. When you were old enough. And strong enough. This is your history. This is your legacy. The world has been too long without a hero. But I'm hoping that it will have one soon. This is your father's most treasured possession, the Guild Seal. It chooses those who have the power inside them, those who have the potential to become legends. Take it. Is something supposed to happen? Teresa, the seer of the spire. I guided your father in his greatest triumph. But you have an even greater destiny ahead of you. The seal awoke at your touch, as it would at no one else's. This means the fate of Albion rests on your shoulders. Before you lies the path you were born to take, and at its end is the kingdom you were born to rule. Like all heroes, you will face many trials, but you cannot pass through these gates alone. You will need to gather followers and gain the support of the people. For now, you have the support of two friends, Jasper, who will serve you always, and Sir Walter Beck, who will be your greatest ally. Together you have already taken the first step in your journey. Walk through the gate and claim your reward. So this place kind of tracks your progress through, through the game after each gate that you open till we get to the last one, and that means we're at the end, so yeah. At least you can know, keep track of where you are at the game through these gates. There is a great power inside you. You merely lack the means to unleash it. Take this. The gauntlet will channel the magic within you. Use it by the tomb in the mausoleum, and the way out of the castle will open for you. You will return here when you have gathered enough followers to reach the next gate. Now go. Walter and Jasper will follow wherever you lead, and one day, perhaps the rest of Albion will do so too.
Well, do you... do you feel any different? I don't know. Try casting a spell. That's supposed to be our only way of getting out of here. You might have mentioned that earlier. And spoil the surprise. <laughs> Neither did I. Still, though, <laughs> it bloody worked. Okay. Somewhat narrow, isn't it? Dark they just food. won't shut up. <laughs> never did care for confined space. I never did care for being poked in the eye or having my head chopped off. What of it? Oh, yeah. I struck a nerve. How about that? I strike a bottle on the bumps? So the only weapon we have at this time is the glove. Ah. So we're just going to be using magic. Grand, spacious, a plentiful supply of oxygen. Just the way a castle's escape route should be. They just won't let me talk. <laughs> there are a couple of things you can get around here, like a silver key, I think. I hesitate to ask, but what is our plan? Other than leaving the castle far behind us, which I wholly approve of, obviously. It's simple. We have to stop Logan. How am I supposed to do that? Even if I am a hero, I'm just one person. Exactly. That is why we need to find allies. And lots of them. Once you prove what you are, people will follow you. And many of them will be willing to fight. But they need a leader. Someone to believe in. Albion needs nothing less than a revolution. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I have uh, something to say about the spells later on that just simply make the character overpowered. Bats, take cover! Well, young hero, this is your chance to go at what you want. Well, let me point out that magic in this game is not that fast, or there's not the variety that there used to be anymore. Excellent! Did you see that, Jasper? Did you see it? Indeed. You're part of the new power. Well, I know I am. Come on. And I'm proud of you too, old friend. I've never seen a man cower with such grace. It is merely a matter of hygiene. Bats are filthy creatures. <laughs> anyway, I think we've just seen the first proof of what you you are the hero who can lead this land in a revolution. That's just the beginning. Okay. They really like to talk a lot. I guess that the game is kind of filled with that, with a lot of cutscenes, but we'll get some gameplay very soon. With let little little conversations like this one's. What's this thing here? Well, I guess it's just decoration. There is a door here that we can't open, but remembering it um, by the end of the game, I'm not sure if I will, but I hope I, I do find that gold key. Because I think I did, I'm just not very sure about it. <laughs> I haven't played this game in a while, so... Yeah... And even though it's the same world, it just seems so different, doesn't it? More bats. Get ready to cast some magic. It always does. Use your spell. So the difference of magic. Another impressive display. Yeah. More, think, more dialogue. This morning, my <laughs> job consisted of laying out clothes for work. Now I'm a midnight snack for bats. <laughs> You'll get used to it. You might have to cover your nose here on. It's the foul stone suit. We are walking on poo. Poo everywhere. 
So you might want to cover your eyes too, Jasper. Not more again. Bats. Time to exterminate a few more bats. At least you get some experience points out of these. And as you notice, there's just one type of experience points through the whole game. It's not divided like well, it used to be. Got the hang of that spell. Shall we proceed? It pretty much gives you the points for everything that you need. Oh, what an unusual stench. I dare say we must be somewhere beneath Powerstone Industrial. Very likely. Not the safest place for us right now. But we should be able to find a way out of the city once we reach the surface. But you gotta be really wise of how you spend those points. Because if you do spend them on stuff that you really don't need, then it'll be really difficult later on to get the stuff that you actually do need. And I'll be picking up the stuff that I need and try and ignore the useless stuff. So there'll be a lot of stuff that you won't see me buy. What is that? I'm pretty sure it's a color skate. Sort of magical transportation system for heroes. I was under the impression the colors gates were all gone. Well, it looks like there's one left at least. Your father must have placed this one here in case he ever needed to use it. It's the same symbol that we saw by the tomb. Do you suppose it's activated in the same way? Well, there's only one way to find out. You know what to do. What is this place? You know, it must be. It is. It's your father's sanctuary. He used to speak of it, but I never thought it was a real place. Well, I don't believe it. Jasper, this book. There's a note with your name on it. Look. That's not possible. For Jasper? Well, I grant you it is possible, but it must be a coincidence. Oh, don't be a dolt. The old king must have left it here for you. What's it called? The Book of Heroes. How extraordinary. Does it tell us how to get out? This really is most remarkable. Everything that we could possibly want to know about heroes and this place is right here in these pages. This map functions as a traveling mechanism. Simply choose where you want to go and, well, it should take you there. Marvelous. Right. We can use that. We'll have plenty of time to explore this place later. Right now, we have a rather large task ahead of us. But I don't even know where to start. Our first stop will be the mountains of Mispeak. There are people there who would make great allies. They won't offer their allegiance easily. But they despise Logan. And if anyone can persuade them, it's a hero. Very good. I will continue to become acquainted with this sanctuary. No doubt we will need to make full use of its facilities. Right, all right then. Find Miss Peak on the map and let's see if that book's telling us the truth. Now, that looks like the dweller camp in Mist Peak, just there. Select that as your destination and you should be taken there. Just like that. How bloody cold it is up here. Come on. The people here call themselves dwellers. They're tough. They're loyal. And like I told you earlier, they hate Logan's guts. Yep. It may not look like much, but this is where the revolution begins. This is what Logan has reduced them to. He's taken control of these mountains and started destroying its forests. I knew they'd have a hard time finding food, 
But I had no idea it was this bad. The man we need to convince is Sabine, a proud old sod, but a good man and a good leader. He won't give his allegiance easily, especially to a prince. Perhaps it's best if I speak to him alone first. You know, maybe you ought to find some new clothes while I talk to Sabine. Something slightly less princely. We don't need this kind of attention. I only have a little bit of gold, but it should be enough. And maybe you can spread what's left among the people. They need it more than we do. Where can I find clothes? Oh, don't worry. You'll find someone willing to take that money off you. Now, wish me good luck. Is any more? So basically, now we gotta go buy uh, clothes. That, Logan, In this game, it. buying clothes is not like on the last one. They pretty much just put like a mannequin that you click on it and then you buy the clothes and that's it and there's really not much of a variety of clothes in this game it's really sad hello so good to have you I'll just buy all Please look around look around I have hello sir this is Jasper uh, hello is is this is this how you use uh, I am speaking to you through the guild seal what an extraordinary device it would seem that as long as you carry the seal, we can communicate freely. Not only that, but you may return to the sanctuary any time you deem it necessary. Might I suggest you do so now and try on your new outfit? Ah, hello. Now, included in the sanctuary is a dressing room. Step through and I'll show you. I've taken the liberty of laying out your clothes on these mannequins, which should serve as convenient storage for any garments you acquired during your travels. Now, why don't you change into your new dweller outfit? There you are. You look just like a dweller. I hope this new outfit is as comfortable as your royal attire, though I suspect the chances of that are quite low. Now that you are properly attired, you should return to Sir Walter. It is time to meet this Sabine that we've heard so much about. So Walter said also to give money to the ones that are asking for it, but in reality it doesn't really change anything, so yeah, just keep going. <laughs> That's more like it. The scruffy look suits you. I've spoken to Sabine explained everything and he's well <laughs> I told you he takes some convincing come on Ooh. out of the way boulder I can't see a thing so royalty walks into our home a prince no less you're a long mile from the castle prince what do you think of our home, then? Do you like what your brother has done to us? These mountains have always been ours. Now Logan's taken them, and he's stripping them of all life. Oh, we're ready to go to war. But why should we follow Logan's kin? You can trust me. You have my word. <laughs> we don't take much stock in words round these parts. We're simple folk. Ain't that right, Boulder? Huh? Then what do you want? Proof. First, prove you are truly, as Walter claims, a hero. This is easily done. There's a secret chamber beneath the town of Brightwall, built by your own father. Only heroes can survive its trials and reach the relics within. Bring me one of these ancient objects and I will believe you. Second, prove you are a warrior worthy of leading us into battle. You can do this by slaying the mercenaries who plague Mist Peak Valley and who have long soured our existence. Third, prove you are a true leader. Persuade our neighbors in Brightwall to share what food they have with us. Boulder. Oh. If we cannot eat, we will die, and the dead make poor allies. Is that all? Yep, that's the lot. Off you go, then. Good luck. Nice knowing you. Come on, boy. It's nice to see Sabine hasn't mellowed with age. But anyway, I know the place he mentioned. 
Your father built the chamber under the Brightwall Academy, Albion's greatest seat of learning. At least it was, until Logan closed it down. Just show the old librarian your guild seal. You'll know what it means. I'll try to find out more about these mercenaries. I'll see you in Brightwall when I have some information. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.